RecIF stands for Requirements Interchange Format. It's an open specification that allows for exchanging the requirements and associated metadata with other systems. One of the nice things about RecIF, is since it's an open standard, is that you can interoperate with any other tools that speak RecIF. Here we're looking at a module with some requirements inside of Rational Doors. And what I've done is export this as a RecIF file. So we're going to jump back into RM, and this is a brand new project, and I'm going to go under Artifacts and select Import. I'll select Import Requirements from a RecIF file and browse to the file that I exported from Rational Doors. I click Upload, and that uploads the file. Clicking Next, I can add some options if I want to import into an existing folder or an existing module. Since this is a clean slate, we'll just click Next, and the import operation begins. All of the artifact types, the modules, and module artifacts are imported. Once the operation completes, a report is generated. Clicking on Show Report will show you a summary of everything that was imported from the RecIF file. This can be used for auditability, as it shows each RecIF ID from the file and the corresponding resource on the RM system that was created. We'll close the wizard and bring up the module that we imported. Taking a look at it, we see that it looks exactly as it did in the system that we exported from. If we go under Manage Project Properties, there's a RecIF tab. Here we see a RecIF definition which defines the data set of a RecIF file. This was created on import, and we see it contains just a single module. If you scroll down, you can also see all of the RecIF files that are generated from a definition. So as you continually round trip RecIF data, you'll be able to see all of the RecIF files that were generated. And for each one, you're able to download that file, as well as view the report that was generated at the time of import or export. So that's a nice way to track data as you're exchanging it with partners. To export data, it's simply a matter of creating a new RecIF definition or reusing an existing one that was created at import time. I'll show you an example of creating a new definition. So you can give it a name, and then there's several options. You can choose to include links and folders, which are on by default, as well as add views if you want to exchange views. You can add artifacts by clicking the Add Artifacts button, and you can add individual requirements, or you can add, uh, you can click on a module or collection and just add that, and it will add the module as well as all of the associated artifacts that it contains. So we'll do that. To export your RecIF file, you simply click on any RecIF definition and click Export. That will start the export wizard. And upon completion, you'll be able to view the report, which is very similar to the import report, and click Download. Clicking Download will download the RecIF file. You can now exchange that RecIF file with other RM repositories. Since RM now supports complete RecIF round trip, a third party could make modifications and then return the file back to you. Upon import, all of the requirements and modules will be merged into the existing system. So that was a quick look at RecIF in RF.